stand by. Now I've made a few introductions over the years on new products, but I can't really remember being this optimistic and this excited before. This car will definitely create a headache or two among the competition in the CD premium segment, which is one of the most competitive segments in the world. Every single detail is in total harmony with the S60's cool, sporty looks. It is the most fun to drive Volvo ever, and no Volvo driver has ever been in command of such an innovative environment before. It's also a car of contrasts. The pure driver orientation makes the S60 the ideal companion for any keen car enthusiast but it also integrates a world first that helps protect one of the most vulnerable road users in modern traffic, and that is the pedestrian. Now, pedestrians account for around 14% of all traffic fatalities in Europe, and our groundbreaking pedestrian detection with full auto brake deploys world-leading technology to help combat this concerning statistic. Now, ever since the first generation S60 was launched, the S60 has been one of the most global of all Volvos. And this goes for the new S60 too. Europe, including Russia, North America and the rest of the world, will each account for around one third of total sales. And our annual target is around 90,000 units, with the first cars delivered early of summer of this year. Now with the S60, hopefully it becomes more obvious that the number 60 in our model range is reserved for our sportiest models. The XC60 was the first step. Now with the all new S60, we're placing ourselves right on the true enthusiast radar screens. And later this year, we'll introduce our new Volvo V60 sports wagon. So we move into the future with decisive momentum and new and exciting cars that will reinforce our emotional brand without compromising any of our classic Volvo virtues. Now, our Vice President of Design, Peter Horbury, is here to take you through some of the key features of the all-new S60. Peter? Emerges from behind the curtain, well done. Thanks, Steve. <laughs> Well, we like to say that the, the all-new S60 is sculpted to move you, since no previous Volvo model has been packed with so much emotion, self-confidence, and the promise of a pure pleasure on the road. I was an immensely proud father of the first generation S60. It took our design language a major step forward. Now, we're taking another huge leap forward. But the basic idea is still the same. A coupe with four doors. In fact, the coupe feeling is so distinctive that the rear doors almost come as a pleasant surprise when you get up close. And we've managed the safety dimension so well that underneath this sleek, sporty body, you will still find all the protective and preventive safety features that make it a true Volvo. But now, the driving experience is ready to live up to the exterior's visual promise. The S60 offers, without a doubt, a more exciting drive than any other Volvo before. During the development process, our chassis team has changed or refined virtually every single detail that influences the drive. And the dynamic chassis is supported by a whole range of very smart electronic systems. For example, the S60 is the first sedan on the market with advanced stability control, detecting skidding at a very early stage thanks to a new roll angle sensor. Corner traction control is another new feature, providing tighter quartering while reducing any tendency to understeer. 
During its first year of production, the S60 will be available with a range of diesel and petrol engines. From the six-cylinder turbocharged T6 with 304 horsepower to the 1.6-litre drive-e diesel with 115 horsepower. Now, our firm action to cut CO2 emissions has resulted in lowered fuel consumption throughout the engine program. On the petrol side, we introduced a new range of four-cylinder direct injection turbocharged petrol engines with a displacement of 2 and 1.6 litres. We're introducing a downsized 2-litre, 5-cylinder turbo diesel with fuel consumption of only 5.2 litres per 100 kilometres. There's also a 1.6-litre drive-e diesel with CO2 emissions below 115 grams. And a bioethanol version will be available on certain markets. Now let's move inside. The interior of the old US-16 brings us up to a new level in terms of perceived quality. We've taken a no-compromise approach when it comes to the quality and craftsmanship of the interior. The S60 is definitely a driver's car, but make no mistake, inside this is still a five-seater with improved seating for everyone, and more generous knee space in the rear compared to the previous version. The top-of-the-line audio system in the new S60 is one of the first car models in the world with Audis's distortion-removing technology, Multi-Q, creating crisp, clear sound with improved sound stage. Okay, that was it from me. Now we'll round this presentation off with a closer look at an astonishing world first in Volvo S60. Pedestrian detection with full auto brake. Just take a look at this. Thank you. The technology can avoid a collision with a pedestrian with speeds up to 35 kilometers per hour. And at higher speeds, the focus is on slowing down the car as much as possible to reduce the fatality risk. Pedestrian detection will make a difference, bringing us closer to our vision of accident-free motoring and definitely making the S60 an outstanding choice. Now the Volvo business will go from strength to strength. We've taken significant actions to reduce our fixed costs without negatively impacting our future products. In fact, as you can see, our future product stream is very strong. We'll continue to deliver cars that are true to the Volvo DNA, but with the all-important added ingredients of beautiful styling and cars that are engaging to drive. So thank you for your attention, enjoy the rest of the show, and be safe out there. Thank you very much.